Should you pursue someone? Should you chase the love of your fucking life? To be honest, I got no fucking idea about that one, but... One thing I know is one of the most diabolical things that you can fucking do is sleep with socks on. What the fuck do you have to gain from that? Like, in my opinion, that's a clear display of mental degradation. It's a clear sign that someone's slowly giving up on fucking life. Now you can put aside uh, alcohol and drug overdose or overuse and bad thing of fucking nicotine. One of the first things that you will find out about your friend and their mental state is finding out if they sleep with fucking socks on or not. And the second question will be if they believe in birds or not, because some people do believe that they work for the bourgeoisie. Me included, to be honest. But <laughs> what the fuck do you have to gain from that? It's a type of thing that you plead the fifth in face of the court, if you live in America, of course, due to itself in criminal nature. Because why the fuck would you expose yourself like that? I feel like it's supposed to be something taboo, that you keep that shit like hidden and secret, you know, for the rest of your fucking life, until your last dying breath, not even before you die, like not even five minutes before you die, they when they'll ask you if you have something to say, like a secret or something, you're like, no, my final message. And then you just fucking die. Because you like at that moment you decide, you know what bro, nope. I'm not gonna fucking reveal the fact that I fucking slept with socks on. Like... There's nothing that good that comes out of that sleeping with socks on. You have nothing to gain from that. Cold? Put another fucking layer on top of your shit. What the fuck do you mean you sleep with socks on? So yeah, man, I just fucking talk about it. That's it. See ya.